Hey guys, Caso Man Rules here. Today's tutorial is on how to get this very nice looking Mac cursor that I have right here. This is the Mac OS X cursor, which I think is a lot nicer looking than the Windows Vista cursor. And I'm going to show you an easy and simple way to get you this. There are many, many, many ways to get you this cursor, but um, this is the simplest and easiest. As you can see, it's black instead of white, it's got the white outline. You want to click on something, let's see, if you're like on the internet and you're going to um, click on something, let's see, there we go, this. You see how you get the finger right there? That is also an OS X thing. And if you, let's see, if you want to run a program, see how it got, that was a really bad example, but here, GIMP, GIMP takes a while. See how that um, rainbow spinning thing right there? That is like the um, arrow spinning um, circle for uh, Vista, and you saw right there for a second that it was kind of a big one. That's like the big spinning blue circle. So it's all the same sort of stuff, but um, it's different, and I think it looks a lot better. By the way, I just made it stop responding on purpose. My computer doesn't suck that bad. So. Um, uh, there are many ways to do this. I'm going to show you the easiest way. Uh, I used to do it with Cursor Effects, which is a program by Stardog, but it kind of isn't very good because it's an overlay instead of the actual mouse, and it's just not the real thing, so it's a pain, and it takes up program space. So, um, to get it like this, open up Firefox and go to this link right here, which will of course be in the description, as always. And you'll see right here in this first post, Mac OS X Mouse Cursor for Windows XP and Vista Easy Installer. And if you read it right here, it gives you a little thing of what it does. Pretty much what it does is you have these um, many different cursors built into Vista already. And um, pointer options, let's see if I can find it. Right here, scheme. As you can see, all of these except for this Mac OS X one, and I guess this My Cursor scheme, which I made a long time ago, all come stock with Vista. And you can look around and they're all a little bit different stuff like that. What this does is it creates a new theme for these and adds it to this list, Mac OS X. And then you just click apply and OK and there you go. So you just download the program, just click download right there. And it's not even a program, it's actually just, it just extracts the files to the right spot. And once you've downloaded that, I've already done it, um, you get right here, oops, it's not in my downloads folder. It's right here on my desktop, Mac OS X Cursor 10 setup. Double click on it, you get this installer. This will install OS X um, Cursors on your computer. Continue, yes. Click next, and it does it, which it already did it for me. And I think it just uninstalled it for me, but, uh, or maybe not, whatever. But, um, and then you will have it right here in your list. Go to it, click apply, OK and you are done and you now have this very nice looking Mac OS X cursor. So thank you for watching this video tutorial by Case of Man Rules. If you want to help out my cause to become um, a YouTube partner and better serve people and help them with their tech issues then please subscribe to my YouTube channel, visit my website which is in the description, also follow me on Twitter which is of course again in the description and um, comment this video, rate it, whatever you want so thank you for watching this video you guys and I will see you on my next tutorial.